welcome everybody to our ABC of Jazz a recap for the Slip Stops with music. Thank you. Greetings and welcome everybody. Welcome to our ABC of Jazz. We're gonna get cracking with our normal warm up, which is, I call it our movement therapy, which is basically I move and you copy me and we just get a little bit warmed up and hopefully it's a bit of fun, just expressing ourselves to the music. What's the tune today, Anna? We've got Sugar Blues. Sugar and Blues, nice slow Blanche, one. Blanche Calloway. Yeah, this is um, Cab Calloway's wife. So let's just move the hips around. Shoulders, shoulders. A little rhythm, we go. Slow, slow, quick, quick, quick. And heel digs. Take it behind for a toe tap. And in front. Take it behind. Set. Mess around. Arms nice and loose. Shoulders nice and loose. Twist. One way, arms the other. Opposite, hip to the arms. And kick. Practice the coordination. Yeah, hopefully we're a little bit warmed up. Yeah, what a great version. Today we are going to do the slip slop. Now the slip slop I learned from Frankie Manning, who was an old veteran dancer, and he used to do it in his partner with Lindy Hop. He would be opposite his partner and they'd go, a slip, a slop, a slip, slop, slip. And that's the step we're gonna to do today. So it's called a slip slop. You're gonna think it's like a chug. Um, 
And the chug, if you don't know, is where you push and your foot just slides along the floor. You can either go forward or back, it doesn't matter. So let's just do that. Let's bend the knees and push the knees back and let the foot chug along the floor. So bend the knees and chug. Nice. And push. Mind the furniture. Bend the knees <laughs> and push. And if you want to chug forward, it's like you somebody you know brushes the knees behind you and they just chug you forward. Chug. Bend the knees and chug forward. Keep a little bend in the knees. And really it's a tap dance movement. Let's go backwards and back and back and back and forward, 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 forward. So now we're actually going to go to the side. We're going to slide. We're going to lift up one leg and we're going to slide. We're going to push off the supporting foot and shuffle to the side. So let's go this way. Think lift this foot off the floor. And as you're lifting, you're going to slide across. You're going to push off that supporting foot, slide, and bring the feet down together. Let me turn around so you can follow me. I'm going to put the weight on the left foot. The right knee. Now, I think going off in the direction I want to slide, which is a little bit to the side, so not forward, to the side. And I'm going to throw that leg out to the side, and it's going to help drag my body across. If you've got a very slippery floor, and if you're wearing something very slippery, shoes, socks, don't go too far because you fall over and you're off. So you just use the arms to help, slide. So notice there was an up down. Now we want to try going back the other way. So I'm pushing off my supporting leg, the right one now. The left knee goes out to the side. The last thing to come off is the toe and slide. So we go one direction, the other direction. One direction, the other direction. Now I know you're, all you guys will be perfect, but normally what I find is people do this and they end up feet apart. So you want to think, bring the feet together. Bring the feet together at the end. So it's got that, it's sort of a comedy look really. So here we go. Let's slide to the right. So we go slip and then slop. Slip. And then stop. Have we got the arms? We, you've got the arms to double check, but could you show how, you, how you're how you lifting your knee? Because we actually are jumping with both feet together. Okay, <laughs> so this is good too. Different well, move. Not, That's not more, quite, not quite more coach angles. Bad, but <laughs> I imagine someone is brushing my knee to the side, and as it goes off to the side, it sort of pulls me in that direction. Let me do it from the side. So you see my knee's not going forward, it's gonna go, up, down, I mean, come forward yeah. a little bit. Up, down. That's it. Up, down, up, down. Start with the knee going up. And I notice, Simon, you've got a little lean in your body. So you're mm. leaning away from the direction that you're going, and then you reverse. So away from the direction. If yeah, I do it without it. the Hello. chug, this way and that way. Now this way and that way. <laughs> the knee and the arms, the knee and the arms. I'm sort of almost looking in the direction I'm going. And slips up. A nice energetic move. Okay, we're going to do a rhythm. It's going to go slow, slow, a quick, 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 quick. We're going to go slow, slow, a quick, quick, quick. In fact, we'll just do three quicks, three quicks. Rather a quick, quick and a slow. Yeah, <laughs> we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, hold eight. I'll try and do it in slow motion, not so easy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, come down, hold eight. Now, if you're dancing Lindy Hop or a partner jive, you can do it with your partner, your hand in hand, and you both do this together. It's a really cool looking move when the two of you do it. One more time, slips up. I put the other arm out for balance, also make sure I don't bash into anyone. We go slip, we go slop, we go slip, slop, slip. And that is our first variation. Can we try some music? Certainly. Take a deep breath, everyone. I think it's already quite tired with <sighs> slipping and stopping around. Uh, do you want Shoe Shine Boy? Yep. We're going to stand on the left foot. One 
mean, maybe I didn't mention, but you're probably doing it anyway. But when I land at the end, slip, slop, drop down, because it gives you a bit more stability. We have trouble with transitions between the slip and the slop and back to the slip. Good, good point. So, I'm lifting my right foot up, I slide with my left foot, and I put the right foot down at the end and change weight. I do the same thing, going to my left now, the left foot comes up, I slide on the right foot, and put the left foot down and pick up the right. So it's gonna be slip, change weight, slop, a slip, slop, slip. So it is about changing weight. Every time you put one foot down, pick the other one up. Yep. Great, yeah. Does that and help? Yeah, I think that helps. And in addition, can you show a little bit, again, how you prep the body, so how you move your weight and angle. And this happens before the beat. So if you start preparing on the one, it's too late. <laughs> so as you count yourself in, or you hear us count, five, six, seven, prepare on eight, so you can jump on or, or chuck on. Okay, let's, uh, let's come back to that one. Let's one do more it. practice, maybe? Okay, one more practice yeah. music. So you're facing or away? Away. Wait for it. Five, six, five, six, seven. My head's not going up and down. I don't know about you guys, I don't know if going, your head's going up and down. But see, my head stays pretty much level. It's not focusing on up and down. Yeah, I think that's missing a little bit. So at the moment, we don't have a lot of travel left to right. It's sort of a jump on the spot for some of you. And for Lucy, I think you could lift, um, accentuate the leg a bit more to give you more... Um, I, I more think a lot movement, of more momentum to the side, yeah. Yeah, that's nice. I think a lot of people are doing this. Uh, so it's not quite actually. Let, let, imagine someone pulls your hip, yeah. and with the hip comes the arm and the knee. Ellen, that's nice, yeah. And reverse. Let's do another move, and then we'll come back to it. We're going to do the pendulum. Yeah, Jess, that's good. Let's stand on the left foot, take the right foot out. It's like one of those, um, what do you call the five ball thing? You know, the, you, you use it on your office desk when you want to calm down. And we go one, two, one, two, three. We're going to pendulum. One, two, one, two, three. I keep the weight a little bit forward on the toes. Oh, you've got a problem with the machine. Oh. And I go one, two, one, two, three. Stand on the left foot, pick up the right. Pendulum, two, quick, quick, slow. Same rhythm, we're gonna do the same rhythm, and we go. One, two, and one, two, three. It's just a variation. Should we try it with music? Yes, sure. Oh, uh, you're not ready for music? Should no, no, I'm fine. Okay. Yeah, I'm okay. Just the pendulum, stand on the left foot. Right there. Yeah. Yeah. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. Five, six, seven. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. Five, six, seven. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. Okay, so what is the aim of the pendulum? So you want to move the legs more than the top of the body. So it's like the legs are moving independently and the aim is to really replace the weight from one foot to the other. Nice, um, nice. I can see it. Yeah. That's looking good. Good. Can we do another variation? I think let's me maybe put it at the top of the slip stop so that we okay. can practice the slip stop quite a bit. Well, well we're going to do a slip stop variation. Let's, I think let's maybe repeat. Uh, I'm not sure. What, what do you mean? Let's repeat the slip stop, the normal slip stop. Okay, normal. back to the regular slip stop first. Stand on the left foot. Now we've done the pendulum, we we'll go back to the slip stop. We go so slip, to the side. slop, slip, slop, slip. Yeah. Nice, Kenton. There's a good chug to the side. Can I be bold and try this? Slip, slop, slip, slip, slip. 
where you can be bold. <laughs> One, two, Let three, to four, you. five, six, seven. <laughs> Let's try it together, slowly. We'll stop halfway. Slip, slot. Now, instead of going back again, we're just going to go in one direction. Touch, touch, touch. Nice. It gives you a bit of a rock star feel, right? Yes. <laughs> we go. Slip, slop, a slip, slip, slip. And notice how Simon is keeping the same angle in his body when he's traveling three times in the same direction. Yeah, so keep, keep pointing into the direction that you're going. Soften the knees, weight on the toes. Five, six, here we go. Slip, slop, a slip, slip, slip. Good. Can you, one last time, if you just stand on your left foot. Facing or away? Away. If you stand on the left hand and sort of prepare for a sit. But without moving the right leg, just show the chug on the left foot. Huh. So that's a little bit what we are missing, is that it's not a jump, but it's not on the spot either. So okay. there's a movement to the side, which is... Like the exercise we pressed at the beginning, my toe doesn't leave the floor. So here on the slip slop, I might come up off the hill, but my toe doesn't leave the floor. Yeah? yeah. Of course, if you're on carpet and things, it might, you <laughs> might have to cheat a little bit. But... Okay, let's do the uh, third variation. Ready? We go. Slip, slop, a slip, slip, slip. Notice I'm leaning away the whole time. How are we doing with that? Yeah, much better. Together, last time. Five, six, seven, we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Helen's found her move. <laughs> Last variation. It's a little, I call it like a hornpipe. We're gonna go. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This time, instead of our slip stop going off to the side, we're gonna take one foot behind, take the other foot behind, and one, Two, three, same rhythm, slow, slow, quick, quick, quick. <laughs> Without go. making knots with your legs. <laughs> we go. Think of one way. Behind. Behind. Two. Behind. A one, two, two, three. Good. Let me do it from the side once. Don't need the arms. And we go. A one, two, a one, two, three. What you will notice is that as I go behind, I'm sort of replacing the foot I was standing on. So I'm not going behind, behind and traveling. I'm trying to stay on the spot. So the other foot chugs forward, chugs forward as one foot comes back. So if you're an Irish dancer, you'll probably be very familiar with this sort of movement. Probably straight. And so, if you're not, good luck. <laughs> yeah, we can try it straight without the uh, sailor bit. Just up, down, up, down. Up, down, up, down, up, down. So from here, think of a reverse bicycle mo motion. The other foot chugs forward, and that foot replaces. You lift up the foot, the other foot chugs forward, and that replaces. And one, and two, and one, two, three. Mm -hmm. Very nice. So all these variations have that chug movement, right? Yeah. And so we're practicing that. Let's try the same sort one. Of move in all directions. Stand on the left foot, slow motion, slip behind, slip behind, 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 and stop. How are we doing with that? Yeah, better. Okay, better one more time. Okay, shall we combine things? Uh, yeah, but I'm going to do a little footwork pattern. Okay. So we're going to combine things with a little routine. And the routine looks like this. We're going to do a badum. So that means. Right, left, boom, and back. Right, left. So let's do it again. Boom, boom, and guess what? We kept to the rhythm. Boom, boom, boom. Do it, yeah. Right, left, and forward, and back, and forward, and back, and forward. Plant the left foot for our first slip slop. Slip, slop, a slip, slop, slip. From here. We're going to have a nice easy move and mess around. Just move this around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're going to have four thigh slaps. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's the routine. So on every second variation, we're going to do a slip slot pattern. So let's do it from the top. If I go to the side and forward and back 
and forward and back and hold. And slip and stop and slip, stop, slip. Mess around. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, same arm to the same leg for the thigh stab. Do you want to show them once? Yeah, I like to do, bring the arm up, drop it down and slap, drop it down and slap. And I also look a little bit in the direction I'm going so it gives it some shape. And you're also moving on the, the opposite hip so that you can balance there. You're if moving that's side straight, to side. I look a little bit to the knee I'm lifting. Yes. Now, if the music's very fast, you won't be able to lift the arm too high, but in the ideal world, you'd lift the hand right up here and it would just drop, boom, and slap. So That's a jazz thigh slap. Make sure to drop the arm rather than lift the arm. Eight, one, two, three. So, as the arm comes down, the leg comes up, boom. When the music's quick, I'll be happy if I'm doing this, but for slow music, this is what we're aiming for. This is what we're looking for. Don't hurt yourself, though. <laughs> okay, now all my thighs are going to be red and raw. Okay, from the top, we go. Burdum, 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 burdum. And slip, and stop, and slip, stop, slip. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, five, repeat. Burdum, 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 and freeze. Now we're going into the pendulum. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mess around. Three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Repeat badums. Badum, 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 badum. Our third slip stop variation. Slip, stop, a slip, slip, slip. Mess around. Four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, five, six, seven. You guessed it. Ba-dum, 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 ba-dum. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. So we've got a routine and we do a different slip stop on each one. How are we doing with that? Uh, pretty good. We've slightly lost the Scottish version. Okay. <laughs> Let's do that one more time. Stand on the left foot. You're going to bring, I'm going to do it without the chug. You're going to bring the right leg in a sort of reverse bicycle motion, a little bit off to the side. It's going to come up and back. You bring the left knee up and back. Yep. You bring the right knee up and back. Left up and back, right up and back. And you notice, because I'm not chugging, I'm going backwards. And one, and two, and one, two, three. But if I chug, slide the other foot forward, and one, and two, and one, two, three. Fun. Okay, it's a cool move yet? Yeah. Should we try that one again? Yeah. So you're set. Five, six, seven. And right, and left. And right and left and right. Nice, yes. Cool. That was good. Okay, should we do the whole routine once without music, then with music? Yeah. So we've got four variations. If you forget which variation, doesn't matter, just do whichever. Right. Keep dancing, that's <laughs> Keep the only dancing. rule. Um, should we, oh no, we'll do it without music. Five, six, badums come first. Right, left, right, left, badum, badum, badum. A slip. A slop, a slip, slop, slip. A mess around. Three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Burdum, 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 pendulum. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, repeat. Burdum, 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 burdum. A slip, a slop, a slip, slip, slip. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, last one. Ba-dum, 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 ba-dum. Say the set. And one, and two, and one, two, three. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven. Was it perfect? Close enough. Close enough. Let's do it one more time. I'll do it facing you and then we'll do it with music. Uh, maybe let's do it. Let's do it once, okay. once more, one more time. Five, six, five, six, seven. Burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them. I slip, I slop, I slip, slop, slip. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. Repeat the burn ups. Burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them. A pendulum, two, a quick, quick slump. A mess around, three, five thigh slaps. A one, three, four, five, six, seven. Burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them. A slip, a stop, a slip, slip, slip. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, last set. Burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them, burn them. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A one, two, three, five, six, seven. Oh yeah, big finish. A five, six, seven. Yeah, nice. Music. Here we go. Music. Oh, we stick to the same song. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> The basic one, yep. If you learn only one thing today, because it's quite a tricky step and one that requires a bit of practice. Don't think lift the knee up, lift it out to the side and it throws your whole body into counterbalance. Yeah, so this is your center, this is the core and my shoulders will counterbalance the knee coming out to the side. So as I go slip, I straighten up, slop, a slip, slop, sit. The other thing to remember, the big focus is I'm going to travel and I want to think up, down and bring the feet together at the end. Together, like a magnet. Together, 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 together. And go to the side and slip and slop and slip, slop, slip. And lastly, maybe can you talk about the chunk and the travelling but leaving the tongue floor? Uh, to the side. So I'm trying to think, I want to jump to the side, but without the toe coming off the floor. So I'm going to jump to the side without the toe. But that does mean I might need to lift the heel up so I can slide to the side. Yep. So if I'm here, I slide to the side, or this way, and I keep the toe on the floor. Does that help? Great, yeah, so if, you, if you've never done the sips up, this is what you want to remember. Uh, the other variations are good fun and to keep you on your toes, quite literally. Um, but yeah, that's your takeaway. Okay. Should we do it one last Let's, time? To should we try the faster music? Sure. I'll do it once away from you and once facing you. Jazz you stop blues. Stop it
Hegelum, Hegelum. One direction. Slip, stop, slip, slip, slip. Last one. Thank you guys, you've learned the slip stops. Well done everybody. Tell all your friends about it. We put all these classes up. You can review them all on our membership site and it's 15 pounds for a month. So you've got 22 of these classes up on the membership site. You've also got some beginner Lindy Hop. You've got some more intermediate uh, jazz. You've got some fun, fun classes. We do some ragtime and there's other classes and there's the swing notes and there's <laughs> the library and there's the forum and there's all the other stuff. So it's pretty good value. So if you want more, that's the place to go. All right, guys, hope you have a great week and we look forward to hopefully seeing you next week. Thank you. Bye. Bye.